my name is Jana. I'm with VintageWhitesBlog.com and today I'm just going to be showing you a super easy way to ruffle crepe paper with a sewing machine. Alright, so we are ready to get started. All you're going to need obviously is a sewing machine and some crepe paper. I thrifted this roll for 10 cents and I'm pretty proud of myself so I just had poured that out. Anyway, just unroll a little bit from your roll and set your tension on your sewing machine to the highest it'll go. Um, mine's five and it works awesome. And just make sure your threads are back there, stick your streamer underneath, and just sew in a straight line. Can't get much easier than that. All right, so that's just with me. Um, putting it through there, I'm not pulling on it, and it's starting to give you a little bit of ruffle. I like more ruffles. If I can get more ruffles in my life, I will do it. Um, so if you hold on to the thread just very gently as you sew, it'll give you more ruffles, and I'll show you how to do that. Okay, so as you can see, there is a lot of beautiful character to this ruffled crepe paper. And, um, I mean, you can do a whole roll of this probably in less than an hour. So it's really easy, really quick, and really cheap. Um, so when you're done, let's say you've done a whole roll or however much you want to do, um, obviously lift your needle and then just bring your crepe paper out. If it rips a little on the end, that's okay. You can just trim it with some scissors and you've got this awesome ruffled garland. Um, we use it for packaging for Christmas, we've used it for Christmas tree garlands, and we would love to know what you guys would use it for if you have any other ideas. So please leave us a comment, um, email us if you have any questions on what we've done, and as always, check back with our blog, vintagewhitesblog.com, for more tutorials.